Thai and U.S. amphibious assault vehicles rush toward the beach, carrying a ground combat element that includes Korean forces. The 31st Marine Expeditionary Unit provides close air support, while Thai Special Forces insert by parachute. This multinational combined amphibious assault marks the start of the 30th annual Cobra Gold exercise. New commanding officer Colonel Andrew McManus says Thai forces spent the last week on board the USS Essex working with the Mu command staff to help organize this assault. Uh, it's been quite a lot and it takes a, some pretty intensive planning just to get it all scheduled on time with our counterparts, but it's been extremely productive. Uh, McManus also says this joint exercise helps promote stability and security throughout the Asia Pacific theater by giving Marines the opportunity to work with their counterparts from multiple nations. Uh, this training right here is actually what the Marine Corps is all about from our very foundation. It's uh, amphibious operations, in-stream offloads, uh, getting dirty, uh, doing what Marines join the Marine Corps to do. Officials say exercises like Cobra Gold also improve the ability for host nation countries to respond to any situation. Gunnery Sergeant Jimmy Stair, Hot Yao Beach, Kingdom of Thailand.